everyone. So in today's video, uh, I'm going to be continuing a series that I started all the way back in the fall, but I've only produced two episodes so far, and that is my movie night series. Now I apologize if I haven't been posting more episodes of this series. Um, if I'm being totally honest with you, I kind of forgot this series existed and basically just focused on making other types of videos, but um, hopefully this summer I can start getting episodes out on a more frequent basis. I'm hoping to get episodes out of this series, if not twice a month, then at the very least once a month. I want to get an episode of the Movie Night series out. So for tonight's Movie Night vlog, uh, I'm going to watch a movie that I definitely should have watched a long time ago. And this has been a movie I've been wanting to watch for a long time, but for some reason I didn't get around to watching it up until now. And one particular viewer of mine, and really good friend, uh, the movie geek, aka Bernardo, this is one of his favorite movies of all time, and he will he has nonstop been saying, like, you need to watch this movie, you need to watch this movie. And as much as I joke about him like harassing me to watch this movie, he's he's absolutely right. It's ridiculous I haven't watched this movie. Now, what is this said movie I've been meaning to watch? Well, that movie is Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. I know, some of you are probably in shock that I still have not seen Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. And I know this is a really popular movie, too, among film fans and all that stuff. And I don't know why I haven't watched it up until this point. I do like the direct director, Edgar Wright. I like Shaun the Dead. I especially really like Baby Driver from from him, and I'm really looking forward to his new film coming out later this year called Last Night in Soho. But anyways, I am super pumped to finally be watching this film for the first time, and uh, let's hope that it's as good as everyone else says it is. So it's a couple days later. Uh, I have finished watching Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, and yeah, this movie is absolutely fantastic. First off, I just want to say that after seeing only three of his films, I already think that Edgar Wright is one of the best directors working in Hollywood today, especially after seeing this film. Like, watching this film in Baby Driver shows me just, just how original just how much he stands out as a director like in baby driver for example like the way he incorporated music throughout that film was incredible while in this film the way he incorporated a uh, distinct visual style was was just just really stood out to me like watching this film and baby driver makes me even more angrier that Edgar Wright has never gotten a best director nomination at the Oscars he should have gotten it both for this and for Baby Driver. Like, 2011 Oscars, they should have took out the director of the King's Speech and instead put that nomination for Edgar Wright. However, the visual style of this film is not the only thing that really stood out to me. What also stood out to me was how, just how funny and entertaining this film was overall. Like, I had such a great time watching this film. Like, I do love how over the top it is. Like, I, I just, I love how awkward Michael Sarah is in this. Like, speaking of Michael Sarah, like, this was the perfect role for Michael Sarah. This is easily the best, like, thing he has ever done in his career, in my opinion. Like, this role was perfect for him because he always plays these, like, awkward, awkward kinds of dudes. And it just worked really well to his advantage in this film. Now, in terms of my problems with this film, I really don't have much. It's really just minor graphs. Like, I feel like maybe it was just a little bit too long and maybe... I felt like the story could have been just a little bit more developed along with some characters, but really that's about it. Other than that, I absolutely think this film is fantastic. Like, Bernardo, if you're watching this video, I totally understand why you were pestering me to watch this film. Like, I should have watched this film a long time ago because this film is, is great. It really is truly great and is easily my favorite Edgar Wright film so far. Speaking of Edgar Wright, I definitely need to see more of his films. I've only seen this, Baby Driver, and Shaun the Dead. And I've really enjoyed all of them so far, but especially this movie. If you have not, for some reason, 
still have not seen this movie, do not make the same mistake I did. Stop watching this video and just go watch this movie right now. You will not be disappointed. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, as I stated in the beginning of the video, I definitely do want to get uh, more of these movie night videos out to you guys because um, I think it's ridiculous. I've only done two so far and I started just like, what, six months ago? Um, in terms of my next movie night vlog, uh, that is going to be another double feature movie night. Like the one I did on Citizen Kane and Mank. Except this one is going to be me re-watching A Quiet Place and watching A Quiet Place Part 2 in theaters. So be on the lookout for that coming out in the next two or three weeks or so. And I also hope that you all enjoyed this video. Uh, if you do enjoy this video and if you're not subscribed yet, please feel free to subscribe. And uh, I hope you all have a great day. Take care, guys.